Looks like we're gonna make a fish trap using a mailbox. Like, if you're gonna do it, guys, you gotta do it right. Bam. It's still recording? Yeah. Welcome to another episode of Monster Mike Fishing. Today, we've got a DIY mailbox fish trap. This is a video that we shot before and very few people actually got to see it. And now it's time to give the shout outs for the last trivia. Peyton Wise, Our Fam Bam, Snake Plays, and Texas Jungle, congrats. There will be another trivia question at the end of this video. Stay tuned, pay attention, comment the answers, and you'll have a chance to win a shout out in their next video. All right, Mike, what do you want to do? Let's make like a crazy fish trap or something. But what are we gonna use for this uh, for this fish trap? I have no idea. No idea at all. Hold on. We might can use something out of here. Oh look look look! What is this? Hey. Hey, yeah, we could do something with that. All right, guys. Well, <laughs> looks like we're gonna make a fish trap using a mailbox. I'm down. <laughs> so we I need we need to figure out. Like, cause this hole's too big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All we gotta do is find some that can like make it like a funnel. We're gonna make what we can find. All right. Oh, my glasses! I can't see into a thing. I am a very blind. I without my glasses. My eyes are closed when the sun come out. There we go. Plastic bag? No. Uh, hey, look at that shape. So we're gonna use this. This was the first item. I can't really reach that. So look, I'm gonna hold this camera. You're gonna, you're gonna extend and grab that. Uh, I think that was a green tea Arizona bottle. Wait, wait, wait. Let me see. Look at all. Look. Look at that. Nasty. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it looked, it looked like you were uh, using the rest oh, of it. Oh, I was just dumping it out. All right, so that's gonna be our little funnel. We needed a smaller hole, and uh, I think it's gonna fit great. And if- That's the good stuff right there, I guess. Ooh, that's that honey. It's time to make the fish trap. Oh, look at that fit. We're gonna have it sticking out like that. And guys, when there's a fish in there, this goes up. Bing. Just kidding. That'd be cool though. Since that's how I'm gonna put it in, it's time to cut this part so they can all go inside the mailbox. Make sure you be, uh, yeah, make sure you be careful cutting if you're trying this at home, you know. That looks good, so they'll go in. Now, um, they could, they could come out easily there, so, Brian, you have anything we can seal just the um, edges with? Hold on, I'll be right back. Here it is, bro. Thank you. Oh, where was it, in the top door to the left? Yeah, top door to the left. Look, this is proof that he doesn't just use it for his dashboard. Come on, man. That's my personal business. Come on, bro. <laughs> <laughs> That's nasty, bro. I gotta touch that. Let's see. If we just tuck this here. There we go. So that that sealed. Like, if you're gonna do it, guys, you gotta do it right. Bam. Oh my gosh. We're, we're talked. I think we're about to catch a fish. We're actually doing this part wrong. It's time to uh, catch some fish. You'll see what I'm talking with about. With our mailbox. DIY mailbox fish trap. So how are you gonna put that bread in there? Shove it in the hole once I put it in the water. <laughs> First ever in the history. Mailbox fish trap. Oh my god, put it over the white thing, yep. white lid. Soak some real quick so it sits. Get that flavor in the water. Move that big piece that's floating right by me. They're gonna get full off that. 
it's one of those like smack your head moments when you realize after you put in the work that you kind of did something wrong kind of like when you're putting together something from ikea and you have a panel backwards or something you finish the whole thing you got to take it all apart just to put it back together again we we think it'll work better if we flip that plastic around so that way it's wider in the top and then it gets smaller and then they're trapped Checking the trap. Empty. Nothing yet. Nothing yet. Alright. I think we gotta give it more time. Like we'll leave it here. We'll go do something for a little while. Come back. Sounds good. Yeah. Alright, Brian, you go uh grab the trap. Oh stupid duck. Baby duck. No. Baby duck. Uh well, at least you know, at the end of the day we all gotta eat. This yeah. is for all the duck lovers out there. Yeah. I'm gonna feed Aw, mother ducker and some kids. Here you go. Get them nice and fat for Thanksgiving. Yeah. For next year. Water turkeys. Water turkeys. All right. What's in? What's in the mailbox fish trap? No. Ooh. Oh, it's emptying out fast. Woo! Draining, draining here. You got it. Yep. be told this is probably the worst fishing <laughs> trap fish trap design we got some look at that tails look at those fins how much do we got dump them right, let's dump them in there like oh it doesn't work mike there's a hole in it oh right there, right here <laughs> all right it worked oh bro oh, these are candies these are candies guys so we set the trap down we gave them, you know, 15 minutes, give or give and take, and we got some baits. Yeah, when I was standing there, they wouldn't go into the dang. Yeah, that's why we were, they were looking at us. How many of that? Guys, comment below if you know the name of this fish. All right, All right. it worked. It worked. We got to try and so, catch a bigger fish or just let them go? Let's, uh, man, I don't know. That's a hard decision. Guys, comment below. If, would you use these for bait to catch bigger fish? Or would you let them go or would you put them in an aquarium comment below and uh we want to see your, your we want to know your ideas this is mike's bait oh yeah we need a bait take it i'll take this one sounds good let's go fish <laughs> So that one bait that's still uh, in his mouth. Yep. Right here. Gulp, gulp. Look at that. Peacock candy. Got that. Got the bait right there. All right. <laughs> Wait, how do I start it? Yeah. All right, guys. It's that time of the show. It's that time. That we do that uh, little trivia question. It's time for trivia. Yep. But uh, so I hope you enjoyed, you know, the mailbox. What was it? A DIY? DIY mailbox fish trap. I hope you enjoyed that. And uh, guys, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed this show. Oh yes, please and share it. All right, it's trivia question time. What is it? For this video. This one. Okay. So. So. How many fish did we catch? How many? What was the brand of the plastic bottle that we used for our fish trap? It was a delicious band. And what kind of species were the fish? Comment your answers below. We'll pick a winner so you can be shouted out in our next video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Again, give this video a thumbs up, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, make sure, make sure the notification bell is on, and please subscribe to my channel. The link is in the description below. Uh, I've got more videos, more behind the scenes of Monster Mike videos. We actually just debunked one of our videos the other day, so if you always wanna check it out, I really appreciate it. But until next time, keep your head up, keep moving forward. Stay quarantined, wash your hands and all that good stuff. And uh, if you have a chance, tight lines. Oh my gosh, guys.